Hey guys, Ryan here for Bender Wins. Hope everyone's doing well today. Here with your daily free picks. All right, guys, so today I have a Major League Baseball play for you guys. A little bit of a lighter card today. There's not a whole lot going on in the sporting world. It's in baseball. Um, no WNBA today, no NBA today. So I got four baseball plays, one NHL, and we have one player prop as well, including I have a two-unit play in baseball going in Masterclass. So um, been doing pretty well with our Tina plays. I'm not going to lie. Yesterday, guys, we did have a Tina play. We won that one. Got a little bit lucky in the ninth inning, but we were owed. We were owed some ninth inning luck. Um, so yeah, uh, fingers crossed. Keep it going today. And hopefully we don't need any ninth inning luck. Hopefully we can get this done nice and early. Um, really like this one today though. So anyways, if you're interested, benderwins.com. Guys, speaking of masterclass, very, very excited. I've been working on this for a little while, built from the ground up new members portal so we got a new members portal we're launching very soon maybe as early as this week and it, people are going to be able to log in see the full card there but above and beyond that guys i'm gonna have so much more information on there um money distribution weather all kinds of different things you know like um sky's the limit with this sky is the absolute limit with this so um very excited for that anyways if you're interested in masterclass guys benderwins.com it's $99 a month, gets you my full card every single day. So for today, guys, we are going to go to the National Hockey League. Um, we are going to go with Colorado and Edmonton under 7 minus 122. So on the surface, guys, I know. Look, you've seen, uh, you've seen these teams do nothing but score, right? And we've seen that throughout the playoffs. However, guys, we're starting to get into a very different scenario here, okay? Um, we're getting into later games in the conference finals, okay? Typically, guys, you know, round one is where you might get a little bit of higher scoring round two. When you get in the conference finals, defense is starting to tighten up, okay? Um, you've had the great one himself. Wayne Gretzky called out these, these two teams and said, guys, you guys have to play some defense, okay? Um, when the great one says that, most people listen, okay? Above and beyond that, look, we're not betting on the fact that these teams are all of a sudden going to play defense just because Wayne Gretzky told them to. No, we're going to look at the actual numbers here, guys, and we're going to make a few key adjustments as well. So look, I ended up going half unit on this one, despite the fact that by the numbers, it says it should be a unit and there could even be an argument where this could be a two unit play. It's very unprecedented. OK, um, here's the record uh, conference finals. OK. Modern history hockey. We're talking modern history, okay? Um, last 20 years, okay? Conference finals, um, games four or later, where the total is seven, okay? How many of those games have gone over? How many have gone under? We don't know because it's never happened. We There has not in modern history been a, a conference final later series game, later series game, being you know, four through seven, where the total has been seven. It just has never existed because defenses tighten up, okay? It's so incredibly unusual to see this, guys, and I, I have to be a part of it. I'm sorry, I do. Okay, money distribution. Now, it's changed a little bit here, okay? A little bit. 41% of bets, 50% of money. It, it was contrarian two seconds ago. It was 49%, but still, um, it's, it's right on that cusp, and I, I still do think that, you know, the sharp money's coming in now still. We're seeing it come in on the under. The public is going to get involved later and the public's going to, you know, do what they do and hammer the over on this one. I have no doubt about that. So I'm hoping to see a contrarian, but again, it is a nice, nice difference. 9% um, difference, 41% of bets, 49% of money, okay? Um, got a system here, guys. Got a couple systems in this one. One of them comes in at... 61.2%, okay, 61.2%. That system, when it is applicable during conference finals, it's six and one, all right? So um, this year has been a very different year when it comes to betting totals in the playoffs. Uh, we've seen a ton of empty net goals. We've seen all kinds of craziness. Um, the Sharps are liking the under on this one, okay? Right now we're seeing three steam and reverse line moves on the under. Um, this was a difficult one for me, guys, to, to remain disciplined and to just go half a unit because, again, these are two high-powered offenses, okay? Um, these are teams that, look, you could go 0-0 zero, zero through one period 
And, you know, six minutes into the second period, it could be 2-2. Two, two. These are the kind of teams that we have playing here. Um, still, with that being said, there is just way too much value to pass up on as we go into a conference finals. Okay, a conference finals. As we get in later in the series, games four and further, these are defensive battle games. And the fact that we're getting a line of seven, we have to bet it. But we also have to, you know, we have to be aware of current situation, current trends. And that's why I elected to go with a half unit play here. Okay, um, that's it for this, guys. Like I said, I got four baseball plays. I got a player prop. Got a two unit play going today. We got a nice two unit streak going. So uh, fingers crossed we keep that going. Love the two unit play today. I think... Um, I mean, we always want to see everything line up on a tee and a play, but I mean, like, everything lines up on this tee and a play. Um, for lack of a better term, you'll have to pardon my friend, beautiful money distribution on it, nice system, um, an absolute boatload, boatload of steam. Um, I've capped this game as being off by an entire run. So, good for us. That's it for us today, guys. Thank you very much. I really appreciate it. And as always, guys, have a very lucky day. And bye for now.